when we talk about diabetes, it's important we talk about type 2 diabetes, which is the adult onset diabetes rather than type 1, which is usually juvenile. Um, and not everyone with type 2 diabetes is overweight or obese. You can get um, type 2 diabetes with normal weight people, but the likelihood of becoming diabetic increases significantly as your weight increases. Um, so that um, is again f a fairly strong association. And similarly, if people that are obese with type 2 diabetes lose significant amounts of weight and maintain that weight loss, their diabetes will improve. Absolutely they can. And, and lots of people with type 2 diabetes, that's recommended to them um, consistently. The problem is that even with diabetes, um, dieting is, uh, is an easy thing to start, but it's a very hard thing to keep on going long term. There's actually really good evidence around um, weight loss surgery and diabetes. There have been trials that have taken groups of people with obesity and diabetes. Um, some of those patients, um, some of those people um, would have had uh, best medical management and, and others might have had an operation. And those patients, those people have been followed long term and the results compared. Those that have weight loss surgery, um, their diabetes is far more likely to be in remission long term their weight is significantly less. There is government funding for weight loss surgery um, and that's distributed to district health boards around the country. So yes, there is um, some resource available, but it is not adequate for the population need.